Yo, what's going on YouTube? It is your boy Ron Trades, and we're back here with another trading breakdown video. In today's video, guys, we're going to be going over my, my Forex Fund Phase 2 10K Live Challenge EU Loan New York Session taking on August 15th, 2023. I did pass my Phase 2 10K account here on this EU scout position. I'm very, very, very proud of myself once again, as I always say inside of my videos because I have came a long way in my development and my, and my maturity level has really went through the roof and I'm very, very, very proud of myself. So let's go ahead and get right into this um, trade breakdown right here, guys. So first and foremost, I came to my one hour time frame and I was already looking for a long position here um, for the fact, simple fact that we're in a discount market. And I understand that if I had billions of dollars, right, if I had a billion dollars to my name and every single time I press a trade, I was getting in for a big size of position. Why would I sell all the way down here? Why would I look for a sale when I can look for sales all the way up, you know, in, in, in this vicinity zone here? So that was my narrative when I came into the charts. Now, I'm not going to lie. I'm not really strong bearish or strong bullish on EU, but I just simply knew for the fact that, hey, we're, we are inside of a discount. This market is now in a discount market. If smart money, hedge funds, big banks, if they want to un unload more sales, they're not going to do it here. They're going to push it up inside of a what? A premium market. So I came into that today with that mindset guys and i pretty much was waiting for price to come right down inside of my area of interest now ron what is your area of interest ron let me go ahead and make my charts bigger so we can get more clear here my area of interest which is simply a poi was this last down close candle after the breaking market structure where's the breaking market structure ron well we had a imbalance they got rebalance where where was it ron right here this is an imbalance they got rebound why are we breaking this we're bearish where are we going once we break it what does that tell you we're not we're not bearish <laughs> we're not bearish if we take this out this is an hour imbalance they got rebalance break a market structure with displacement what do we return down to ron last down close candle on the um one hour time frame we did have 8 30 news today so i'm gonna just put my line right here this is the one hour bullish order block so from here i went down to my five minute time frame as you guys can see 8 30 news right we had 8 30 manipulation so price ran down past my po while i did not enter i wanted to see a i wanted to see a lower time frame in that shift before i actually you know got in so price ran down inside of my area of interest it hit it traded through we had another market structure shift and balance they got rebalance at 755 what do we do? We broke it right here at 8.45, right? What's the narrative though? Well, so before I keep going, what's the narrative? Well, what am I looking for already? Loans. So this what? This fit my what? My narrative. Why did it fit my narrative, Ron? Well, I just showed you guys that I wanted to see price move away from this um this discount market. I wanted to see price come inside of what? The one hour bullish order block. This is this black line right here. As a matter of fact, let me just make it bigger for you guys. I don't want, I don't want anyone confused here. This big black line right here, this is my one hour bullish order block. Price touched my one hour bullish order block. After price hit my one hour bullish order block, what did it do? We had a five minute market structure shift. Where's your MS shift at, Ron? In balance, they got rebalance. Why are we taking these out if we are what? AKA bearish. It's not the case. We're not bearish today. This is a breaker structure. So after my breaker structure right here, guys, breaker structure. So after the break of structure, I went to my three minute time frame. Yes, I went to my three minute time frame. As you guys can see right here, we have a very, very, very small volume imbalance right here. You guys can see it had a small volume imbalance. As price came down inside of this volume imbalance, as you guys can see, this is my entry. I entered the moment price started coming inside this volume. Yes, I did take drawdown. Yes, it was not a sniper entry. No, this, I took a little bit of drawdown. And guess what? That's okay, but I knew what I was looking for. Took my volume imbalance entry. As price came inside the volume and balance, took my entries here, and we went up right inside of this daily order block. So price ran right up inside the daily order block, and look at the reaction right now, getting off this daily, you know, daily order block. So very, very, very simple setup here, guys. Using the one hour point of interest, five minute market structure shift, and a three minute entry. So yeah, guys, very simple setup here. Very proud of myself. Nice long position here. Let's go ahead and go right here. It's one about oh he didn't pad it. Yeah, right here in your face. Um, phase two book. I'm um, very proud of myself. 5% here, guys. Another 10K live account. 
very proud of myself, man. Now I just got to wait. I think I got to place one or two more trades so I can hit my five minimum de trading days and I get my certificate and get my live account um, credentials. So, yeah, guys, going to be it, man. Very proud of myself. Thank you guys for all the support. I'm going to catch you guys in the next video. And as always, trade safely.